I hope this is good. <laughs> hope to me is um, faith, you know. Um, and lately I've been experiencing a lot of faith. And basically for me what it means is just letting go and letting life be what it is. Um, I can't say that I've always felt that way, but I think as I get older I know that, you know, life is going to happen the way it's going to happen. And I'm not in control. And I have hope that I can just be happy with the results, you know. I have hope that my family will be happy, that my family will be healthy. And basically that's what hope is. And I hope, like I said, will always include my having faith to believe that that'll be true for me. I have a new definition of hope that I discovered just a couple of days ago after going through a period of challenges and, and just personal exploration about what it is that I really want to do and what it is that I think I'm here for in this life. And what I came to realize is that for me, hope is knowing that I am the master of my own emancipation. Hi. Hope is when you are lost in a dark labyrinth and you begin to see your way to the light. Hope is moving towards the positive and staying in the moment. Hi, I'm Karen Lee Larson. I'm with Sirens of Shrine. I sing and I play violin. And the question is, what is hope to me? And I've thought about this question and I think of what are the possibilities that we can dream up as creative people. Um, you know, I think about somebody who invents something that's never been done before, never been seen before, never been heard before. To me, that's part of what hope is, like creating something just brand new. You know, possibilities are endless, that we can always dream up more things, new things, different things, creative things, wonderful things, you know, amazing things. That's, we can do that, and we have that ability. And I think, uh, especially right now with the way people are feeling, you know, there's a recession going on. Um, also, Saturn, I guess, is in retrograde for people who are into that kind of thing. And it's supposed to end in September and things are supposed to get better, but it's a difficult time right now. So I think if we can think about, you know, using this as an opportunity to uh, just spur our creativity, what can we do? What, what are these possibilities that we can do? And that's what I think of when I think of hope. For me, hope is something that I feel should be overcome. I think hope and fear are in the same category because they both have to do with what is going to happen rather than what is happening. Well, hope to me, it's actually a word that I put in letters a lot, often just hope you're doing fine, hope you're doing well, hope things work out. It's kind of a wish word. And it's just like a wish word. Hey, hope is a good intention that encourages us to move forward in life, you know? It's, it's step by step, one step after the other. Basically, hope lets us know that all things are possible. Hope is medicine. Hope is better things in the future. Hope, for me, is kind of like water. Cold water on a warm summer day. It, it refreshes, it revitalizes. It gives you the energy to keep going. It's what gives you the ability to have faith, the ability to believe that you can be what you want to be, do what you want to do, live the life that you want. It's what keeps you going. And without faith and without hope, you've got despair. Merciful God, it never gets that bad for you because hope springs eternal. Hope is the place where we dance in possibilities and Providence greets us at the door. 
I think hope is endless possibilities and ever-expanding horizons. Hello, my name is Kiki Hawkins and uh, today I'm talking about what hope is to me. Hope is faith and believing in your dreams and working to achieve that. Faith and hope are coming together in community and we building that strong foundation from the bottom so that we all can rise like the phoenix. Faith is having love, faith and hope are having great dreams for the future and allowing yourself to be free and just believe and do it.